Welcome everybody to KPE Paranormal. Tonight I am at this very old cemetery that I found while driving around and it's deep inside the woods and it's very very secluded. I'm going to be doing a paranormal investigation here. Let me know what you all hear and see in this video with the top step down in the comments. Make sure to like this video, share this video out. This cemetery that I'm going to be investigating here tonight is called Brulst Creek Cemetery. Let me know if y'all here or see anything in this video. Let's get started. It says eighteen eighty nine. I think this is one six I think that says sixteen sixty eight I think I'm not sure let me know say sixteen sixty eight sixteen sixty eight no that can't be right I'm not sure I think seventeen sixty eight yeah seventeen sixty eight and eighteen eighty nine See, these are very, very old graves. You could barely read them. Not sure what that one says. This one. Eighteen hundred. Died 1800? No, 1803. 1803. So these graves are like from the 1800s and older. These are very ancient, ancient old gravestones. Yeah. Yeah. You see, we're surrounded by woods. Completely surrounded. See if we could read any more of the graves. That was like that was like a family section there too. Yeah. Eighteen forty two to eighteen seventy six, eighteen sixty four to eighteen seventy nine. Eighteen thirty five to nineteen twelve. And then the wife, eighteen forty seven and nineteen oh two. And these spirits out here that are willing to communicate with me tonight. My name is Dylan. You can speak it to my camera.
right now what I'm doing is a walkthrough and then I'm going to do the Estes method here at the cemetery. I'm going to go ahead and turn on a spare talker while I do the walkthrough. We're going to do about roughly until 1.20 in the morning and then we're going to do like a little cat ball session and then an Estes method. I got the spare talker on. We're going to do it till like about 1.20 in the morning and then we're going to use a cat ball and go then forward. we're going to use the Estes method and the spare talker just said to go forward so we're going to go forward. All right, we're going forward. Somehow that one called call the yeah. house. Maybe that's where they want us at. This ground is actually sinking in. Be careful. Sarah. Sarah. You look the same. I look the same. Or maybe Sarah's around here. Oh, oh wow, I almost fell backwards oh, on hill. Look. It said Sarah. Yes. Look. Spare oh, talker said Sarah. Feels. And there's Sarah. Let me pull the phone out so I can show you all. It says Sarah. Right? And look right here. Sarah. Sarah, are you here with us? Are you here with us, Sarah? Goodbye. Goodbye. Do you not want to communicate with us? So the spirit talker said Sarah. And right when I was wanting to see if we could find a grave that said Sarah, somehow we managed to walk up to Sarah's grave. That was cool. They knew we were going to go that way and come out that way. Yeah. Oh, I like all those. It's a paint. Hmm? A light. No, I said decoration. Oh. Well, I want to eat the uh, eight cent because they look like far enough. Yeah. This is pretty cool. I 
Looks like a Bible. That's pretty. Cry. Cry. The church. The church. There. Yeah. Well, somebody touched me on my back. Let me recreate that. Because something probably moved inside my backpack. No, something literally touched me on my back. Because it did do it again. Did you touch me on my back? Prisoner. Prisoner. Was that a prisoner before or one of y'all? Can we that one? Maybe. That was the f my breath that you seen a fire in the camera. We will touch you. You will touch us. 122. I'm going to get the cat ball out of my backpack and I'm going to place it somewhere and hopefully they'll be able to communicate with the cat ball. Any spirits that are here that we communicated with so far today? I placed this cat ball right here by this uh, grave. If any of the spirits could come over here and touch that cat ball, it will light up.
Can you touch the cat ball? Is a person, is a spirit here that tested Dylan? It's 36 degrees out here. It's okay to touch the cat ball. It'll let us know that you're here. Maybe try a different area. Mm -hmm. So, if you are st still with us, can you please touch the cat ball or William? It will light up. Can you touch the cat ball, please? That'll light up red and blue. And I forgot the other color, but it might be your favorite color. Do you like red? You like red, touch the cat ball. Do you like blue? Thank you for trying. I appreciate you trying. Right now what I'm getting ready to do is the Estes Method here at the cemetery at Bros Creek Cemetery to see what we could get. It just died. Really just dead. And was it fully sauce? Mm hmm. Look. This thing was fully charged. I was getting ready to do the SS method. And it's already dead. Watch. Hold on, let me show you all again. So that's all on, right? Watch. 
and it's just dead. This tank was fully charged. I guess they did not want to do the Estes method here at the cemetery because this thing was fully charged. Um, we could do the Necrophonic. So since the S box died, we're gonna use the Necrophonic here. And it was fully charged before I left the house too. Okay, I got the Necrophonic app on. Let's see what kind of EVPs we could get. Hello. How are you doing? You doing good? You got a quick question? Yes, you do? What's your question? Are you dead? Yes, unfortunately you are dead. You're not alive. Are you stuck here? You are? Can you go into the light? No, you cannot. Are you blocked? By something? Are you blocked by another spirit? Yes. Do not let that spirit block you from going into the light. Okay? Do not be afraid to go into the light. Go towards the light. Let no other spirit stop you. You're at the light. You are? I heard a yes. Yep, that's amazing. You love me? Did you cross over? Did you cross over? Yes. 
You see your mother? You got a question? Your name's Adam? Do you get visitors here often? No. What is the oldest grave here? What year? Do you have any messages? There's evil. Is there evil at the cemetery? You said there's a portal? It's by my truck? Is that right? So there's a portal by my truck, right? Can you say my name? My name is Dylan. Can you say my name? I'm going to close this session. Can you say goodbye? Goodbye. Thank you for communicating with me tonight.
Bye. Thank you. Bye. This concludes this investigation here at Brooks Creek Cemetery. The evidence that we have captured here at the cemetery is when I used a spirit talker, it said the name Sarah, and we came upon Sarah's grave. Like we found Sarah's grave, like something drawn us to her grave. That was pretty cool. We tried the cat ball, no success on that. There was like. I guess the spirits needed more energy to be able to use the cat ball to communicate. I was going to try to use the S-Box to do the essence method, but I charged it before I left the house today. And all of a sudden, as soon as we got here, it's like, it just died. It's like the spirits drained it that quick. It was like full charge too. Um, so we just decided to use Necrophyta to get to see what kind of EVPs we could get here at the cemetery. I think we got some great EVPs through the Necrophonic app. Let me know what y'all think about those. Also, let me know what y'all heard or seen in this video with the tab step down in the comments. Make sure to like this video, share this video out. We got like about an hour and 40 minute drive back home from the cemetery. Make sure to subscribe to the channel for more upcoming videos. And until next time, KPE Paranormal. Love and peace.